Now in the 5G access network between the user equipment and the GNB, we have a direct signaling link over the wireless channel. And between the user equipment and the EMF in the 5G core network, we have another direct signaling link and this direct signaling link passes through the GNB. And we can see that there is no other direct signaling link between the user equipment and any other network function in the 5G network. Now the AMF stands for access and the mobility management function. And this direct signaling link between AMF in the core network and the user equipment, it is called as the non-access stratum signaling and it is also abbreviated as the NAS signaling. And in the access network between the user equipment and the GNB, we have the access stratum signaling. And it is also called as the RRC signaling, where RRC stands for radio resource control. So we have the NAS signaling or the NAS protocol between the EMF and the user equipment. And we have the RRC protocol between the GNB and the user equipment in the access network. Now these two signalings are these two signaling protocols are supported on the lower layers by these protocol layers. And the combination of all these protocols that are working on different layers we call it as the control plane stack. 